Welcome to the lesson on narrow QRS complex. Pediatric tachyarrhythmias are first divided into narrow complex or wide complex tachycardia. In this video, we'll discuss the narrow QRS complex tachycardias. Narrow QRS complex tachycardias include atrial flutter, sinus tachycardia, and supraventricular tachycardia, or SVT. Atrial flutter is an uncommon rhythm distinguished on an ECG as a sawtooth pattern. It is caused by an abnormal reentrant pathway that causes the atria to beat very quickly and ineffectively. Atrial contractions may exceed 300 beats per minute, but not all of these will reach the AV node and cause a ventricular contraction. Most often, as a PALS provider, you'll have to distinguish between two similar narrow QRS complex tachyarrhythmias, sinus tachycardia and supraventricular tachycardia, or SVT. SVT is more commonly caused by accessory pathway reentry, AV node reentry, and ectopic atrial focus. For details and differences between sinus tachycardia and SVT, please refer to Table 17 in your corresponding PALS manual. This concludes our lesson on narrow QRS complex. Next, we'll review wide QRS complex.